welcome back and happy Veterans Day. We're glad you're joining us today for KJAZZ this morning. And we have expected maternity with us today. And we all know when we're pregnant, it's hard to find fashion that looks great. And that's mm -hmm. what you guys focus on. Yep, that's exactly right. We try to help the pregnant women be able to keep her sense of style while going through her pregnancy. She's going through a tough time anyway, and so we want to help her feel as great as she can. And that's not easy to do. It's, no, <laughs> with a growing body, I mean, everyone knows if your body is growing in ways that you're uncomfortable with or you're not used to, right. if you if you can feel good by making yourself look good, then it makes all the difference in the world. No and Becca, question. I know that some people, and myself included, while we're pregnant, we think, oh, maybe we can just wear like normal clothes and just get them a size bigger, which at some point just doesn't really work out. No, it doesn't. You know, um, for example, you're shoulders aren't going to grow a ton, but your belly is, and a lot of different things are. Right. So a mainly. lot of different things, too. <laughs> belly seemed like that was the last thing to grow on me. Exactly. Okay. <laughs> so if you can dress, you know, to make things fit you where they need to, but allow you growing room, then that's what the point is. Okay. Talk to and, us about Jen here. Right. What, okay. is, what is she wearing? So Jen, one of the main things about going through this transitional period with the seasons and with your body mm -hmm. is to layer. Okay. You're going to be really hot. You need to be able to take things off. So we have this really cute medium weight pea coat okay. that she can wear as a sweater or she can just wear out and about during the day. Probably midwinter when you're pregnant. Yeah, yes, exactly, <laughs> exactly. So then if you take off, if you want to take off your cute little scarf and then take off your coat, you can show, we show that um, underneath she's also layered. Oh, that is so cute. Okay, so now do you guys have the scarves at your store too? We don't. Okay. But we will be getting some. Okay. <laughs> well, you don't, don't need you to. Worry. Okay. We like that. But anyway, so she's got this cute top on, which is a really lightweight mesh fabric. Mm -hmm. And then underneath, she has a cute shade shirt. It's also cute reversed if she's just wearing the long sleeve with the shirt on the outside. Mm -hmm. So either way, if she starts to get warm, she can just take off a layer. Right. And then if she starts to get cool again, she can put it back on. Yeah, that's great. And I like how you can do it, you know, put the shade on top or mm -hmm. that. Because one thing we know is we don't want to spend that much money when we're pregnant. That gives you more options to there be are, Yes, there are so many different. Getting a great pair of jeans is key. If if you right. have one to two great pair of jeans, then you're golden. Uh -huh. um, and then just some different fun accessories and some different fun tops will really help you get further along in your pregnancy. And what would you say are some of the basics you need? I mean, you need the jeans. Would you say one to two pairs of jeans? Yep, one and to what, two. And what, like a black pair of pants, brown? Uh -huh, Basically what pants. you need for work in general. Yeah, exactly. Um, and then the main thing, you know, is just getting different tops, mm -hmm. different tops that flatter your body. Okay. And we have the fabrics these days are so great and so stretchy mm -hmm. that you can get things that fit you when you're smaller and they can hug your belly if you want, and then as you grow, the shirt just stretches with you. But it doesn't ever look like it's too big. Right. Okay. And then your husband can wear them, like for Thanksgiving and stuff. Oh, you know, after you eat like that on big meal. Exactly. Yeah, yeah the Thanksgiving that. Friends. <laughs> yes. Exactly. <laughs> okay. Well, that's great information. You guys have plenty, I'm sure, of the under and then the whole over yep. the belly mm -hmm. type pants. Yeah. We've got different types of panels. We've got long jeans. Mm -hmm. That's really key for a lot of women. <laughs> Not me, but not me. <laughs> All right, well, great information. Where are you guys located? We're located at 7694 South Union Park Avenue, mm -hmm. which is about 1300 East and 78 South in Salt Lake. Okay, what are you next to? Is there any like? Um, we're in the new where the new movie theater is. Oh, okay. In okay. Union Heights Shopping yep. Center. Yeah, know where that is. Yep. All right. And we're also online at expectedmaternity.com. Okay, but if you can, it's probably a good idea to try stuff on. Yeah, okay. it's always good to try things. Right. And we have much more in the store than we do online. Oh, really? So it's a lot more fun anyway. Great to know. Okay, <laughs> hey, and Jen, good luck. So you're not just wearing the pillow, you are actually pregnant. Yeah. And how long are you? Yeah. 16 weeks. 16 weeks. Yep. Almost the halfway point. Yeah, Four that's months. great. That's great. I know. I always have to convert. It takes a while. <laughs> Matt's hard sometimes. 16 well, great job. Hard. You're great. Thank you. Yeah. All right, Becca, thank you so much. Thank you so much for having us. All right, more to come here on KJazz this morning. Is school more difficult for boys or girls? We are connecting with kids to find out. Plus, a new music video written and produced here in Utah is turning the Twilight love story into a song.